Hello everyone, Commander Kingfish here, and we're back in uh, CSX Heavy Hall, Train Sim World, and we're going to do the uh, Sand Patch Sunrise. So, uh, we're not in Cumberland Yard at this point. We're up the tracks quite a ways, and it's dark out nighttime. So, we're going to uh, go ahead and go and hop into our locomotive, and that's over here. Uh, I did hit L for my light so that I could uh, somewhat see what I'm doing once I get into the train, into the loco. And let's walk around in a cab, see if I can kind of bumble my way over there. And you're going to have to get the hell out of the seat. There we go. Now let's turn the cab lights on. I think there's one up here. Yeah. Let's, there we go. And then we need to get our loco lights on. So let's, oh, let's, all right, come on. Gauge lights on. Ditched lights on. There we go. Let's get our... We need to set this to dim. There we go. And this one to bright, I believe. Yep. To bright. There we go. Ah, we need to set the reverser to forward. Okay. And we need to release the bale. Uh, and we need to give the throttle one one notch, but first we should honk the horn. Alright, and let's give uh, the throttle one notch. Now it's uh, 10 miles an hour coming out of the yard here. So let's uh, kick this off now and go ahead and coast. We are going uphill, so we're going to have to kind of keep feathering that back and forth. We might go over a little bit. And we've got to go up and hook onto a train that. Uh, had a failure, so uh, uh, that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to go up and hook up to that. We got to stop at a red signal. So once we get up to uh, close to the uh, signals, I'll uh, catch back up with you. Okay, so we're getting pretty close to where we need to uh, stop up here. So. I'm going to start slowing this thing down a little bit, and we should, uh, just by coasting, be able to pretty good. As we get a little bit closer, I'll start hitting the brakes up here a little bit, and we're getting, so let's start uh, slowing it down somewhat. All right, let's take the brakes off. That's enough to, and there's the red light that I can see up there, so, uh, we, as we're approaching, we should be just about there. I can see it coming up. Give it uh, a little bit of power to keep us rolling. And let's see if we can stop this so that we don't uh, fail the uh, scenario. Go ahead and give it some break and stop this thing. There we go. Now we need to uh, 
request pass signal at danger. So let's hit our tab key. And then we should be able to click that off. So now we can go ahead and uh, proceed on up. We've got to hook on to the uh, stranded uh, train, which is just a little uh, up here, a little bit uh, farther, just past the red light, actually. And it should be coming up here pretty quick. There it is. I can see it's starting to come up. Give it just a little bit of juice to keep it going. Keep it going. We're almost there. There we go. Need to wait for a moment. All right, now we get to set everything. So let's put our uh, reverser to neutral. Oop, no, that's wrong one. That's the throttle. Let's set our reverser to neutral. We need to set the auto brake to hands off. Handle off, the cutoff switch to cut out. There we go. And we need to set this to trail six. There we go. Uh, let's turn off our. Let's see. Switch off the engine run, uh, the field generator off, and our fuel pump off. Okay. And we need to switch the radio. to off. There we go. Let's close this. And then we need to switch off our lights. That's off. That's off. That's off. And switch that off. There we go. And we get to change cab, so let's get up. Let's turn our flashlight on so we can see where in the hell we're going here. You sit tight there, buddy. Out the door. Okay. Walk over to the other engine. Down the steps. Right. Shut the door and sit in the seat. Now let's turn our lights on up here. There we go. We can see something here now. Ah, let's see. Let's turn this light on. Uh, flip the radio to on. There we go. Close this. We need to set this to... Uh, 
Let's see, set the headlights to be controlling unit. Uh, coupled at long end. Let's get it right here. Either end. Long end. Long hood end. There we go. And then turn our lights on down here. This needs to be set to dim. And this to bright. Then we got to switch our systems on. So this needs to go to on, on, on. There we go. And we need to set this to lead, which is there. Uh, this needs to be set to freight. There we go. And then we want to apply about 30%. There we go, close enough. Set this to release. And brake pressure is up. Now we gotta stop at the Cumberland Hopper Yard track four and so we're starting to roll a little bit let's give it a little bit of juice now we're going to be heading downhill for the first part so uh, we're going to do a lot of uh, once we get this thing rolling We've got a 1.5% uh, downgrade, so uh, we're going to get this rolling. Let's give it a little more juice just to get going. It's climbing ever so steadily. And while that's doing that, let's just hop outside the cab real briefly here. And we can see that it's still dark out. The sun's just starting to come up. We've got our lights all set. And so let's go back inside the cab. And I think at this point, I will catch up with you as we get down uh, into Cumberland. All right, we're starting to come into the uh, town of Cumberland. Uh, we don't have too much farther to go, although it is gonna take us a little bit to get there because we do have to slow down somewhat. And let's uh, hop outside the uh, cab. We uh, do this, let me make a slight adjustment just a little bit here. Since we are starting to hit a bit of a grade, want to make sure we keep our speed down. And let's hop outside the cab. And here it is, nighttime in, uh, or early morning in the town of Cumberland. Let's swing around. And the sun should be coming up, as we can see. And you can kind of see our uh, uh, set of uh, coal cars that we're pulling in. So let's swing back around. Uh-oh, we've got to get slowed down here a little bit. And there we go. We were kind of right on the money there. We'll just kind of hang outside the cab here as we cruise on in. We're about 2.3 miles from uh, our uh, destination. Uh, let's take some of this brake off so we don't slow down. We're starting to head up a little bit of a hill here. So we can kind of just, uh, let's just take that all the way off. Although we do have a 15 mile an hour 
right here another switch over so we're pretty much right on the money there and since uh, we're bringing this uh, disabled train in I think the uh, dispatch has our uh, switches all set for us so we don't have to worry about uh, setting any switches to roll into where we need to stop and let's go ahead and release that since we are heading uphill we might have to uh, give it a little bit of juice as we roll on through crossing over uh, an overpass there We've got a, a train that's sitting here waiting for us to get this uh, disabled uh, train off the tracks out of his way so that he can get rolling down the road. And it looks like it's going to be a beautiful sunrise here in uh, Cumberland and uh, as we hit the Cumberland Station. Nice little town here in Cumberland. I need to figure out a little bit of the history here, and maybe I'll do that in one of the other scenarios. Talk a little bit about the history of uh, this uh, yard and uh, the town of Cumberland. And looks like we're starting to pick up a little bit of speed here, so let's uh, slow it down just a little bit. so far cruising right on in we've been uh, rolling for about uh, 58 minutes in this scenario so uh, uh, we should be right on track I think the scenario itself calls for about uh, 70 minutes so I think we're right on track to do this scenario more early morning traffic there Starting to slow down a little bit too much. Let's release that brake a bit. And there's that sunrise starting to come up. Give it a little more brake so we don't get speeding too much. Pretty much holding the speed limit like we should. Ah, what a nice looking morning. And we're about a mile and a half from our destination. Let's swing back around. And I'll catch that back up with you once we hit the yard up here. Okay, we're starting to enter the yard and we're uh, getting close. We should be uh, uh, rolling on to track number four here pretty quick. Uh, I think this is the switch right here. Yep. And this should we should be entering track number four right now. As you can see, we've got about 1.1, about a mile to go. Uh, so we got a little ways to go down here, but we're cruising along, we're just coasting, we've got a lot of weight pushing us, so, 
and we're on a level grade so we'll try to maintain our speed and then uh, stop up here without having to do too much uh, gyration around between between the uh, uh, adding a bit of power and the brakes and we're starting to get a little bit of a downhill grade so let's uh, give it a little bit of brake Swing around one more time here to take a look at the sunrise. I guess there's not too much of a sunrise yet. Alright, let's swing back around here. have just about a half a mile to go here. There we go. Breaks off just a little bit so we can kind of keep coasting on in. Don't want to lose too much of our speed. Pretty good so far. We should give it just a little bit of break. Start slowing down again, and let's uh, let's go back inside the cab as we pull up to a stop. Oh wow! Look at that uh, morning sun. Let's get this down a little bit. All right, how are we doing here? Let's just give it a little bit more break. We have a lot of weight pushing us. Good, slowing down pretty good. We're gonna have to give it maybe a little bit more break here, just see how it continues to do. Let's give it just a bit more. Take a little bit, take a little bit of it off. A little more off. Let's see if we can kind of just. There we go. All right. All right. Let's give it some break. bit more a little bit 
there, full application. Ah, come on, come on, get me there. All right, full application. That should about do it. Nice, all right. And that was just uh, 70 uh, minutes so far. So let's go ahead and uh, turn our lights off. Turn that off. Come on, there we go. Turn that off. Turn that off. Gauge lights are already off. Uh, we need to turn this one off. And we get to walk over to the car. All right, well, let's hop up and uh, let's uh, hop out out here. Shut that door. Although I think I, I normally put the reverser in neutral and I forgot to do that when I got off of there and it didn't tell me to do that. So let's go ahead and run on up here. And there's our rig right over there. All right, we're going to pop on over here. And that's the uh, Sandpatch Sunrise uh, scenario. So uh, I hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, I like it just for the fact that, you know, you, you're coming up in the sunrise. It's a little bit different perspective, although it's pretty dark for most of the scenario. Uh, that's why I'll cut a lot of that out. So anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, and uh, with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will, uh, I will see you all in the next video. Come on, finish the scenario. There we go. All right, now I will see you all in the next video. Thanks, everyone, for watching.